ಸಹನಾವತು ಸಹನೋ ಬುನಕ್ತು ಸಹ ವೀರ್ಯಂಕರವಾವಗೈ ತೇಜಸ್ವಿನಾವತಿ ತಮಸ್ತು ಮಾ ವಿಶಾವಗೈ ಓಂ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಎಕ್ಸಲೆನ್ಸ್ is the product of will and the skill what do you mean by that so i must have the willingness and if i have got the willingness then i can develop the skill okay now we are talking about the learning today see there are some people have a lower iq but they top of the world okay there are some people who have a high iq but they are in the very lower level why i think we have to understand okay now we want to discuss about about this the learning this is what you call the learning curve okay now what is the learning curve and what is the benefit of learning this particular one okay now all of us have so many field to excel okay whatever that you are going to choose the field that means this learning curve is applicable whether you are going to be in the marketing servicing or a production or you know farming and whatever your politics or whatever you want so the learning curve applicable equally okay that is one now i would like to explain to you what is the meaning of the theta factor when i say theta is the angle okay now for example when i say the angle that makes all the difference in the learning so which i am going to explain to you little later now let me tell you for example the performance measure and also the time see a man who is just joining a their job or start anything also in life that means the beginning will be slow okay there is a slow beginning so the curve will be little less okay now once you are able to understand the same beginner can go to a acceleration for the learning and after some time i keep on telling you know it depends upon the age and the stage okay when you are young that means you can learn very fast but when you become old that means your capacity to learn and retain will become less it is natural so that means i always keep on telling people you must learn at your young age so that you will never forget okay that is one see for example this particular one see the learning and the time okay see when you are inexperienced see that means you cannot learn much but you have got a lot to learn see when you don't have any experience that means everything is good you have to keep on learning 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 okay that means there will be a kind of a learning when you are inexperienced but you cannot be in the same style okay you have to get the experience what do you do for that you must really engage in other words you must have a lot of commitment in whatever that you are doing so whether you are marketing whether you are servicing or playing cricket or farming or cooking whatever you are telling is it that means you have to have a kind of commitment you have to a kind of a engagement that means you have to put your 100% effort in learning okay that means the second phase so initially you are inexperienced but you are always longing to learn longing to learn you must be longing to learn that means you have to 
have a lot of you know, kind of a day engagement with a lot of commitments. Then after over a period of time, it becomes flat. Then whatever that you are able to learn, that you are able to retain is great. Okay. Now I just want to give you a small little example in my own study. Okay. I told you about the theta factor. So what do you mean by the theta factor? The angle, the angle of learning. Okay. Now, for example, the people who have got a low resources and a higher aspiration. So what do you mean by aspiration? That means I want to do something. Okay. There are some politicians, they want to do something for the country. For them, that is the most important thing. Before my term over, I want to do something for the country. So you want to do something. There's a lot of aspiration. Isn't it? Now, there are people who have got a low resources, maybe from the village or from the rural areas. Isn't it? They have got a lower resources. But I got a tremendous amount of the aspiration. He wants to do it. Come what may. He is willing to put 100% effort. He wants to have a lot of, you know, the hard work. So he is able to do that. That is one. For example, this particular, the sketch. That means, what do you do about that? In the Y axis, you talk about the IQ. Okay. In the X is a time in years. Okay. And also, the kind of the theta, that is the angle. Please listen very carefully. Now it is a beautiful study. The people who are recruited from the campus interview with the same qualification, taught by the same lecturer, okay, they join in an organization with the same salary. Okay, all of them are good. See, with a different kind of the IQ. Now let me explain to you. There are three guys. One is the Raman, Krishnan, and the Ramakrishnan. Okay. Now the theta factor are totally different. See for the Raman, okay, the learning curve, what do you call the, the theta factor is only 15 degrees. Okay. And Krishnan, he has got no IQ is less. That is, you know, 80. Okay, that means his learning curve is more. That means, you know, 30 degrees. That is the theta factor. Now, if you look at this, you know, the Ramakrishna, his IQ is only 60. <laughs> but he is absolutely have a kind of a the passion and the aspiration to do something while he always feels that his IQ is little lesser. Okay. Now he has to put a lot of effort. That means his theta factor is 45. So please listen very carefully. See Raman, his IQ is more. He's more intelligent. He's a distinction student. Okay. But as a, the commitment to learn is less. There is a 15 uh, degree. Now, as a Christian, his IQ is less, but his capacity to learn is more. That is a theta factor is 30. The Ramakrishna, his IQ is the least, that is a 60, but his aspiration is amazing. That means his learning curve is around 45. Okay. Now look at this particular slide. When you are talking about this joining time in the, any organization or in a career, okay, they got a different IQ. But that which makes the difference is the learning curve. That is the theta factor. Okay. Now for example, this IQ, the intelligent quotient and the time is equal to capability. That means the capacity or the capability of the 
Raman Krishna and Rama Krishna are different because of the learning curve. See, it is, doesn't really matter. Okay, what is the IQ when they join the organization or in the any profession? But the way in which they are able to really dedicate themselves in the chosen, see, that means that capacity will be determined. Okay, now when I talk about this particular subject, let everyone understand. Okay, don't bother about his background. Whether you are from the village, you are from the city, or you are from the rich family, or from a middle class family, or a lower middle class family, it doesn't really matter. See, God has given you the tremendous amount of free will for you. Now you have to learn. There is no other substitute to come up in life. And every second, you must always think, am I learning, am I learning, am I learning? Every experience is a learning experience. Don't be under the impression that your learning is stopped when you come out from the school, from the college. Okay, that every experience that you are having from every second, that means you are able to learn and then register, right? And then retain and recall at the right time. Okay, now what is that you understood this particular one? That means, doesn't really matter what, what IQ is there. See, there are some people who have got a very high IQ and the learning curve was amazing. There are some people, the IQ is very less, but the learning curve is amazing. Now the question is, the capacity to learn, to come up in life depends upon the product of the willingness and the skill. So I must have the will and also automatically I will get the skill. Okay, that is one. See, for example, there are a lot of people who have got the mastery of the subjects. They are very good. We ask them to give a lecture. Okay, and they do a fantastic job. When it is asked to implement, then there is a tragedy. <clears throat> they are not able to do it. Why? They got the knowledge. Okay, but they are not able to implement. Now that is where the question of, you know, this skill. That means you must have the skill to execute. Now there are so many factors. That is one is, you know, your own efforts and also the time. Okay, and also the, the grace of God. Okay, but having understood everything, that means, yes, now I know that the learning curve makes all the difference. Okay, and I am, must be committed. This, you know, the, the case study of Raman, Krishna and Ramakrishna will give you a fantastic, you know, insight. That means, yes, let me understand my capacity. Now I must keep on maximizing my capacity. How can I do that? There is only one and the only way is to learn. You can keep on improving your learning curve. Okay, then whatever that you do it, please understand this particular one. I always used to tell my HR people, just hire people for attitude and then watch the learning curve. And uh, it works very well. Okay. Take care. All the best. Om Sarve Bhavantu Sukhinaha Sarve Santi Niramaya Sarve Bhadra Nipashyantu Makas Chiddukha Bhagbhavet Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti.